day, YouTube, and welcome to another episode of the Albano Rhino Beer View. Rhino, Ali Alejandro, from La Brasiere de Montreal. This is London Ruby, Longley. It also goes by this name, which it was switched to. Is that the uh, French name? Ugh. Yeah, that's the French name, just English. Yeah, it's Anglais. And this one's London Ruby. And it says Anglais up there. But yeah, so, uh... A light beer, English style, I'm going to guess it's going to be like a bitter. English bitter. It's not bad, actually. It's pretty good. Had a little sip of it. It's good. It has a very stern English man on the label. It's good. It's not the old staring man. <clears throat> yeah, that's, that's the man. Not the old Scottish? The old Scottish? Ironically, on the beer called Black Watch. You goddamn kids. <laughs> and it was given to a Colombian. Alrighty, so like minorities get yeah, my lawn. A nice deep red color, looks nice. A little bit of head, some viscosity on it, not much. That smells really good, actually. Very malty, with a little tiny hint of a fruit flavor. That'd be the ruby. <laughs> <laughs> Don't you know ruby fruit is great? <laughs> Excellent. <laughs> oh. Yeah, it smells really good, malty and fruity. Yep. Nothing else. Let's try it. Good, everyone. I remember Sandman's talking about it, I'm sorry. Can't help it. That is very malty. It's, yeah, it's pure malt. Pure malt. Pure malt. Pure malt. Pure. Much like the Honey Monster's mom. That's right, pure malt. Malty. Well, I, I don't find it that offensive, though. No, it's not offensive <laughs> at all. I love it. It's really, really... Mom, I'm Chad loves you. you. <laughs> um, really, really sweet. Chad loves you, Mom. <laughs> There is a, still a little fruity twang on it, and the background is a nice, subtle bitterness. That's the rubies. <laughs> the ruby fruit, yes. <laughs> the ruby. Thank you, Ken. No, that's, um, that's the anglaise part. <laughs> <laughs> that's where the bitter comes from? <laughs> well, the bitterness took, is from took, the French oppression. They took a British ginger kid and put him in the sun, and then they distilled him into beer. <laughs> Would he have more of a smoky flavor? Hey, that's a ginger, all right? <laughs> smoky flavor. 775 for me. I actually like this quite a bit. Um, it very well could be Rube Tastic. Could be. 75 for me. <laughs> could be some Rubes very involved. Drinkable. Very drinkable. <sighs> Thank very you guys. Drinkable. La Brassiere de Montreal, London Ruby. Very Fuck drinkable. you all. I was drinking when you said it was Rube Tastic. <laughs> <laughs> I know, that's why I timed it. <laughs> Lee came up with a very good one liner there. Didn't stop drinking. He just, yeah, I'm just going to breathe anyways. I don't care. <laughs> 